Welcome back to Jersey Matters. Dawn stands Lamenti here in the Parkside Learning Garden in Camden, New Jersey. What's growing here is rooted in a concept that is captivating some of the biggest corporations in the region. Jersey fresh gardens full of delicious vegetables are taking root in workplaces and major corporations like Campbell's Soup Company and Comcast, all thanks to an innovative concept by David Wagstaff of Linwood, New Jersey, the son of farmers who founded Alfria.com. They're interested in bringing food to their employees farm fresh from the you know farm to the workplace and we're we're looking to support them on that as well as helping to support the community that they're part of and they're looking to partner with us to do that they're one of many companies we're also working with local hospital systems to help their employees eat healthfully you think doctors they already know what to do and nurses right but they still need the help the convenience aspect of bringing farm fresh food to the workplace. It's even difficult at times to find sustainable food locally, even if you know what you want. We help solve that problem for them. Wagstaff told me he started out in 2016 using an Uber style business model to connect gardeners and growers with families who wanted fresh homegrown fruits and vegetables. His company, Alfria, now serves employers, big and small, delivering wellness programs through workshops. When people grow their own, they eat more fruits and vegetables. That makes them happier, healthier, higher cognitive function. They're more productive and miss less days of work, and it even gets better. What could be better than that? <laughs> Employ the employees' kids also learn about gardening, and as they learn about it, they get engaged, and they eat more fruits and vegetables. Just this week, Campbell's Soup Company announced from its world headquarters in Camden, New Jersey, that it's joining the Plant-Based Foods Association, the nation's only trade group representing the fast-growing plant-based food sector. Now, consumers are demanding nutritious alternatives with a record rise in food allergies like dairy, nuts, and gluten. It's a health benefit for Campbell's 16,500 employees as well as to the community. It's really neat to be able to offer an employee benefit that's fun and engaging for employees. It builds teams. It has the potential for teams to get together around building a, a garden for their uh, workplace, but then they can also give back to the community and the community can give back to them. So it's a nice interplay. It's a really unique opportunity to be able to serve the employees and serve the community mutually. That mutual benefit is felt by local nonprofits serving communities like Camden. This green space helps create green jobs. In some ways, an incubator for gardening. So seeing what our programs can, can transform an entire household, uh, you know, three to five hundred dollars, uh, you know, a person can turn them into a, a small business. And so, you know, watching that happen is just, you know, it doesn't get better than this. With new backing from billion dollar corporations, Wagstaff hopes his Jersey homegrown idea grows into a national platform that empowers all Americans to get our hands a little dirty in the name of better health and nutrition. I really love it. It feels like the right time. People are interested in healthful eating. In addition to that, it's nice to do something that makes a difference for people. For more information, you can head to alfria.com. Reporting for Jersey Matters, Dawn Stein's Lamenti. Up next, Larry's commentary.